Welcome and thank you for joining me in this stretching session. This session we're going to use, besides the exercise mat, we're going to use a set of floor cloth or something you can slide on and make sure that of course you are on a floor where you can do the sliding because we're going to use the floor cloth to get into a lot of stretching position. So um, just bring along and uh, let's go. So we're going to start out by doing a side weight position here. So we are standing with the side here and we are moving that right leg back and staying put on your left. So you're not going to lift up your heel, you are just going to push that heel down and using the sliding moment movement to get that stretch all the way down in your uh, Achilles uh, and your lower calf. So pushing it back and this, if this is too much, you can just go a little bit up again. So just by either sliding further back or pushing your foot in again. You can all uh, do the stretching after what fits you the best. So pushing back with that heel and we are moving that heel up and lifting that up on our toe and we are going down here getting a nice tight squeeze here and feel it in our hip on your back leg so supporting with your hands and slightly slide further in to the stretch and inhaling and exhaling as we go further into that stretch position and a little bit of engagement here in your core area and your pelvic floor easing off your neck and getting into a nice Stretch here, supporting with your hands on the floor. So we are going to use this inhale and getting into that further stretch as we are exhaling. Moving our leg up towards the standing foot and inhaling and exhaling, going further back into the stretch. Moving our foot up again, and now we are putting our knee on top of the floor cloth and going further back in here. So pushing that hip down, lifting your heel up so you're not resting directly on your kneecap and move it further back in so you can feel the stretch but still be able to breathe nice and easy. So pushing forward so you are resting up above your knees so or your knee and pushing that heel towards your buttocks for an even better stretch slowly lowering down here get that floor, floor, floor cloth back in and you are pushing your foot up and you are sitting down on that right leg and you are moving further down with that knee towards the the floor so you can feel a good stretch in your right foot. Make sure you're not tilting out on your right side, but try to get all toes into this stretch. And let's ease off, move back in and turning around, feet now the opposite foot is in front and we are sliding back, keeping that chest up, moving that leg back and make sure that you're pushing your heel down towards that floor cloth, keeping your straight position here. Shoulders are easy and nicely away from your ears and pushing that heel back. So every time you're exhaling, you're going a little bit further into the stretch. And we're getting up on our toe, lifting up the heel and slowly moving down. Hands, one hand on each side of your front leg and pushing that hip towards the floor and feel the great stretch over your hips, a good stretch, 
especially if you are sitting a lot during the day, then it's a good way to get that stretch and let your glute come back into work. Inhaling and exhaling a bit further in to the stretch. We are moving your back leg up and inhaling and exhaling and get a further out into the stretch. So still resting our hands on each side of our front leg. So pushing it down towards the floor. <sighs> yep, moving that floor cloth back in, putting our knee on top and moving that heel up. So we are resting above our kneecap, leaning it back a bit forward on our front leg. And then we're just gonna move all the way out. So get a bit further into the stretch, pulling that heel up towards your buttocks and resting on your hands, pushing down. So keep that foot up so you are Having a nice position on your back leg. So every time you're moving your foot towards your glute, you are feeling a nicer stretch coming along in your hip area. Slowly down and we're going to put that foot up, bring it up here. We're going to sit down and lean a bit forward. So knees the knee are pointing towards the floor and we are trying to keep all toes right underneath here so you get a stretch. So get up on that front part of your foot, pushing it slowly down that knee, relaxing in your shoulders. And we are easing off here. Hands are on the floor and we are moving out to the back and we are lifting our chest up. If it's too much to be up here, we are just gonna go all the way down resting here. Inhaling and exhaling. So shoulders nicely tucked away from your ears and Moving that chest upwards, bring our knees in, squeezing and moving out again and hips are down and you can always rest on your forearms instead if you think it's too much to be up here in this position. And one more to go. Bring those knees up, get a nice stretch in your lower back and moving out again and hips are coming down, maybe further down, resting on your forearms. A nice good extension here, getting a stretch in your ab area. Again, a very nice stretch if you're sitting along a lot along the day. Squeezing, bringing knees up, staying put here, moving your buttocks towards the floor so you get a nice lower back stretch. And we are moving up to a standing position and move your right leg out to the side, resting your left arm on your left leg. So try to feel the stretch in your inner thigh. Maybe you can go all the way down for a bit of support with your arm. So one is resting on the same leg and moving your leg out to the side, getting that, get, getting that inner thigh stretch, engaging your core muscle. Feel it all the way down and avoid making a movement in your ankle joint, try to make it a full long line all the way down. Inhaling, exhaling, get, get further into that stretch. 
and move your leg up and alternative to the other side resting that arm on the same leg and maybe you can go further down resting with one arm here checking out your ankle joint and lifting up your chest engaging your core muscle so a great nice inhale and exhale as you go further into the stretch bring that leg in and narrow position here and we're just gonna stay put here hands are behind our close packed here with our angles and moving your chest towards your legs a nice stretch in your hamstring muscle easing off your neck And we are rolling up vertebra at the time, moving up all the way, getting our shoulders back down. Yep, we are coming down on our exercise mat and we are putting one hand on our left hand on our floor cloth and our right hand we're gonna put on our forearm and then we're gonna slide underneath and turning and using the floor cloth to get a little bit further into the stretch just sliding out to the side let your head down on the floor and your knees are resting on your exercise mat and as we're lying here with a bit of a distance between our knees we are moving that opposite arm up and above our head, getting a nice stretch around our shoulder blades. So just sliding up and pulling our glutes towards our heels. Easing off your head, resting in your face. Moving left arm back to position, up we go, and we are coming down on our forearm, twisting in, starting out by feeling the stretch around your left shoulder area, and when you get the stretch, you are moving that right arm up and above, sliding on the floor cloth, Getting that buttocks back towards your heels. Remember the breathing. And move that leg back and into center. Resting on both forearms, we are sliding up right arm out to the side and turning our head and turning our body a bit so we can get a nice stretch in our chest area on our right side so going from center out to the side turning away from the floor cloth on the right arm feel the stretch and you can go further out with the floor cloth just by sliding a little bit more Easing off your head, just resting on the floor. And back into center and turning the opposite way and moving that arm out to the side, pushing your elbow down into the floor cloth, turning a bit, looking away from the arm, which we are stretching and feel it in your chest area and bring that arm in again and 
moving forward and pushing back with your buttocks and get a nice stretch here. Move the floor close back into center, getting back on our toes and we are letting go of the floor cloth, opening up all the way up to a standing position, easing off our shoulders and our back and we are going for the inhale and exhale opening up and inhale again and exhale two more to go bring that air in and one more inhale and exhale so thank you for joining me hope you got a bit of a stretch out of this and uh, hopefully i will see you soon on some of the other my other session here on my channel until then stay happy stay healthy and stay strong take good care bye